I was trying to get my adapter. This came with the radio uh, bought. Actually, it came with this radio from a guy named Glenn in Phoenix. Really nice guy. Um, and the radio didn't work, but anyway, he gave me an uh, MD-1 and this adapter. And I don't know what happened, but I noticed it just doesn't work. And I was like, oh, there's literally... It, it doesn't look like it ever soldered. So, I mean, there's one that's never been soldered. That one, apparently it just sat there. So, um, we'll just turn on the iron here, heat it up, and uh, we'll get in here and uh, tack it in there. And we're going to just tack it in there. We will uh, get some some flux on the end of it and then properly solder it. How's that sound? We're just waiting for this thing to get up to speed. Uh, we're pretty close. Um, these they sell at uh, certain Home Depots and stuff and um, sometimes they're a really good deal. Um, better than like buying them from other places. But uh, I don't remember exactly what it was. It was like a hundred something dollars. Um, See, what did I do with my solder? And I think it's actually outside because I was soldering the loop. And that means I left everything outside, including um, soldering iron. But we'll just use this stuff, get this on here, and uh, I have some really old stuff right here. This is great stuff. So. Go in here, clean up the end of this. And I don't really like doing it like this, but I don't want to mess around in here too much. Yeah, this solder looks nasty. Like, I think they must have used some other kind of solder. It just kind of dries kind of dull. So, yeah, we got that in there. So, hopefully that was, you know, all the reason everything was bad. So, um... We'll just put this back on the radio and see how she does. All right, here we go. Oh, it's working great. Okay, we're going to put it back together now.